Cueless macros allow you to trigger other console events when executing a queue. To add a macro to a queue, select the queue you want and ensure edit mode is on. Touch the add macro button and an undefined macro will be added to the selected queue. You can add multiple macros to a single queue. To define the macro, touch the undefined box. The header options change to allow you to edit the macro. The three buttons on the right allow you to delete the current macro, delete all macros assigned to this queue, and apply any macro commands you assign when you're done. Touch the drop down arrow to select the command. The first three commands allow you to trigger, release, or pause a queue list. Select allows you to select a queue list for editing and makes it active in the selected queue list and queue list values windows. Select main selects the queue list but also makes it the selected for the master playback buttons. Choose your command and an additional box opens to allow you to choose the queue list. Touch apply to complete the command. Go to Bank allows you to change banks on the main console as well as any wings you might be using. Select Go to Bank, then select the bank you want, and finally choose the main console or wing module to change. Touch Apply to complete the command. Script Execute is not implemented. Release All allows you to release all queue lists, chases, and overrides. Release all queue lists allows you to release all queue lists and chases, and release all overrides will release all overrides. Select one of these options, then choose the type of release you want. You can also choose a queue list or override that will not be released. Touch apply to complete the command. Set queue list values allows you to set an output level for a queue list. Select set queue list value, then select a queue list, and finally, select an output level. Touch Apply to complete the command. MIDI macros and external macros will be covered in additional tutorials. Release queue lists allows you to select a range of queue lists to be released. Select Release queue lists, then choose the starting and the ending queue list numbers. Then choose a release time. You can choose default to have each list release in its default time, or choose one of the times from the list. Touch Apply to complete the command. Release Banks allows you to release all inactive banks or a specific bank that you choose. Select Release Banks, choose the banks to be released, then choose a release time. You can choose default to have each list release in its default time, or choose one of the times from the list. Touch Apply to complete the command. Release This Queue List allows you to release the queue list triggering the macro.